Mind you, when I saw him on the app, he went to the Chick-fil-A and then he went ahead and brought his ass over here. So how are you lying to me when I saw when me on to I them? Me know. everybody it's Omari Bryant we're back for another video so as you guys can tell by the title down below we're there for done some boy career because people think so that you can take your hard-earned money and order your food and they just gonna go ahead and take it I don't think so so <laughs> I hope everybody is fine excuse my voice a little bit I am kind of getting over a little um, I guess like a post nasal drift or something like that. I woke up um, yesterday and my nose was running and stuff like that, but we're good. We're fine. We're about to go ahead and dive right into this video. I definitely appreciate you guys who voted for this particular story time. Thank you so much. Um, if you want to be notified on all the updates and everything before it hits the channel, definitely go ahead and check out my Instagram. That's how you'll be able to stay up to date with me, know what's going on. Um, currently, I'm still in Atlanta right now. I decided to go ahead and just take a little day off today, make some content, you know, because you guys definitely deserve it. I also have a vlog that's coming. It's a little older, um, but it'll be like kind of picking up from the last from the last vlog I did upload. So definitely go ahead and stay tuned and check that out. So without further ado, let's go ahead and finish some Dutty Boy career. And yes, we're going to go ahead and be using some Patois. I will go ahead and translate a little bit as I'm talking. So definitely stay tuned. Let's dive right in all right so the other day as you guys know if you were paying attention to me on instagram <laughs> i did go ahead and put up a poll talking about um sharing this experience it literally just happened the other day so you guys are getting this story time fresh off the press maybe okay <laughs> so what i mean to tell you uh they have some trifling ass people out there that I, I understand it's tough times out there it's tough times for everybody right now like i'm not even gonna cap like it's it's been a challenge and trust and believe i was like uh is living in the united states even worth it anymore but that's besides the point that's a whole nother video for a whole nother day so your boy was hungry and decided to go ahead and order him some food okay um and yes i know y'all probably gonna get on me as soon as i say this place because they are not lgbtqia friendly <laughs> and which is chick-fil-a um, but let's be real, here in Georgia, there is a Chick-fil-A that is on every corner. Like, literally, every corner, every corner. Can't miss it. So this particular Chick-fil-A is probably, like, maybe touching two miles away from me. It's not too, too far. So I always order from this particular Chick-fil-A. They typically get my order right and all the time and everything. So I went ahead, you know, when I'm on little Uber Eats, you know, went ahead and placed my orders. Spent harder money, you know, you'll... Yup! 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 Those of y'all that don't know, I am a barber and I stand on my feet, you know, and, and make people look good to get my little coin and people be playing with me. But this is the city of scammers. <laughs> so, make a long story short, went ahead, ordered my food, I'm waiting for it to arrive, obviously. So I'm checking through the app and everything, and we going ahead, waiting for our food, you know, I'm over here. You know, doing my little thing, watching something on YouTube, I think, at the time. And um, right when it was, like, you know, because, like, there's, like, a, a, like a turn or whatever. So, like, anytime when I get to, like, a particular turn, I know, like, I have enough time because I've done this so much now because I don't have a car at the moment. So, keep that in mind. And I have to kind of depend on these delivery apps so I can eat most of the time conveniently. Um, so I can have more varieties instead of, like, Chinese food and pizza. Because simply, that's the only thing that you can order these days without using like some sort of app or something that you've already didn't have to pay for like that's kind of like the only thing that you could do those two things these days besides cash like I, that's what i can think of comment below if you guys have like different other suggestions and stuff like that that i could do without using the app but it's more convenient to typically through the app and then you know that it's already paid for you don't have to worry about like cash and stuff because i don't like to carry cash anyways but anyways um <clears throat> So I go outside and I am up waiting in the driveway 
it's a long driveway, so I come out through the back, walk around, I'm waiting like in the middle of the driveway, and I see the car come up and approach. It stops at like the mailbox area. There's like a bush there and stuff like that. So it's kind of stops at the mailbox area. And um, I'm standing there. Mind you now, we did not make eye contact throughout this whole situation. Mind you now. We didn't. We never lock eyes. We never lock eyes at all. Okay. We didn't lock eyes. However, however, this individual decided to go ahead, slow his ass down and whoop right there quietly. And then decided to go ahead and complete the order. But me not have no food and I'm on. I'm on them empty. The nigga was too stunned to speak. So I'm standing there like, what? I'm, I'm dumbfounded as fuck, like. The nigga was too stunned to speak. So, you, 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 you what? You got to eat my food? So shortly after, the car drives off. And I'm standing there like, I have my phone in my hand. And I'm looking around like, is he gonna turn around or something like that? So I give it a few moments and then I go to the app and like, I'm panicking at this point. I'm like, why take my phone, what? So I'm, I'm frantically going through the app, whatever, and I go to the help section and it was an area that said, you did not receive your order. So I clicked on that and it promised me to call him. So I go ahead and I pick up the phone and I call him and I'm like, he answers and he's like, what's up? I said, uh, did you just come here and like attempt a delivery or something like that? He was like, no, I ain't got your food. I ain't got your food. And I'm like, okay, you already sounding guilty as it is. Number one, and I already saw you. You, you was in the act. Why did you get your food? Um, they never gave me your order, just that way. Around. Mind you, when I saw him on the app, he went to the Chick-fil-A, and then he went ahead and brought his ass over here. So, how are you lying to me when I saw when me on to I them? Me know, see you. Give him a food and I'm on. So you're going to sit there and lie? Really? So as much as I didn't want to them to clot, I didn't. And I just went ahead and heard him out, and then he hangs up on me. The nigga was too stunned to speak. So I went ahead and I tried to call him again, he didn't answer. So I'm like, fine, forget it. At this point, like, I already don't got got. Let me just eat this L, whatever. What is the next step? Like, am I getting a refund? Am I able to go and put in my order again? Like, what's up? Because I, at the end of the day, I'm hungry still. The belly is empty, I need to eat, right? So I go ahead. Um, I go through the whole app situation so like you have to wait like I think it's like five minutes or something like that after the quote-unquote delivery and then you're able to go ahead and it gives you two options to um, either just get a credit or you can go ahead and get a full refund but a full refund will take a couple of days so I'm like no so I'm gonna want a free want a refund right now more I'm a, more I'm a food so I went ahead and picked the credit option and I replaced my order and I was able to get my food but it's just a simple fact of like any other time there's supposed to be a pin that's supposed to be given. You know, comment below. Like, I, I want to hear you guys' point of view on this. The pin should be for every order because th this is getting out of hand. Like, I understand that we are in quote unquote a mm, recession. <laughs> and then, like, they kind of trying to sugarcoat it currently at the moment. But let, 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 let's be real. <laughs> and I really feel like that things need to be a little bit more secure because. Say, for instance, it was my last, right? And I didn't know that I could go ahead and get a refund or whatever the case may be. I would have been asked out. I would have been SOL. And those of y'all that know, those delivery apps, they're expensive. Very expensive. They're not cheap at all. So for somebody for going and teeth my blood clad food, I'm going to stand up on my two foot them for going and eat. Mm -mm, it didn't sit right with me. So... Uh, I don't know if it like recorded him or whatever. I'm not sure about that because uh, I, I just went ahead and just said I didn't get my food. So I don't know if that counts against him or anything like that, but this is this is his name. Mm -hmm. This is his name. This is the order and all that. But uh, yeah, I just I just went ahead and just was like, 
okay. But on a brighter note, the new driver that I had, he was actually very nice. He pulled up in the driver. He was very handsome. Handed me my food, and you know, we kept we we kept we kept the day going. And I just I was just like, bro, I don't got God. Like, and I've been using Uber Eats for for a good while now. Like, honestly, like. I was using, I've been a frequent user of Uber Eats for quite a while. Just, and it's, it's just simply because of like my situation right now. It's not really like the most feasible to cook and stuff like that. But you already know, I prefer to cook. If you're OG and you've been here for a while and you watch the vlogs and stuff like that, you know I love to throw down in the kitchen. And I cannot wait to do that again because what I mean to tell you, eating out is very expensive and it's not very healthy for you. Yeah. But anyways, guys, I hope this story time, you guys enjoyed it. I hope it was well. It was what you guys were looking for. Um, so, yeah, that just happened the other day. And I was just like, really? Bruh. But I've ordered since then, again, obviously, and I've been fine. But that, that was just like a, an eye opener right there. But definitely, guys, protect your coins, you know. And if anybody from Uber sees this, make it mandatory for every order to have a pin okay don't just single out orders because people take advantage of that all right so my birthday is coming up soon and i will be having an amazon wish list coming up really really soon um i have another vlog that's coming out soon and it'll be more details in that vlog so definitely stay tuned i appreciate you guys so so much and i I'm sending so much positive vibes and energy to you guys, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.